morning loves welcome back or welcome to my channel i feel like ever since i got this ice roller i've just been starting all my videos out like this because it's just like the perfect way to wake up and i can do it while i'm talking i didn't really someone's calling me okay sorry that was my mom i was gonna say that i didn't really film any like thing of my morning routine today usually with these types of videos i always like to film at least like me making breakfast or like you know me waking up just getting my morning started but my room is not in the state to film content right now let me just show you what i'm talking about yeah i'm also eating breakfast in my room which i never really do but we currently don't have our dining table pretty much packed almost everything up because tomorrow is move-in day we finally found a house in case you guys haven't been keeping up with the last couple of vlogs my family and i are moving and it was really stressful at first because we only had a couple of weeks to find a house before we closed on this one and we just weren't finding anything in the last vlog we did some house hunting but we didn't end up liking any of the houses we looked at we recently like last weekend looked at a couple of houses that we actually really like and we got word on monday that one of them accepted our offer so we obviously took it and now it's thursday and we're already getting started on the moving process because like i said we literally close on our house tomorrow so we have to like go through things really fast even though we technically move in tomorrow the reason why i'm starting the vlog today is because today i'm actually going to go pick up the keys both of my parents are working today so i have to go and get the keys in a couple of hours i'm just like really excited because i haven't even seen the house yet in person obviously my parents have but when they went to go see it i wasn't available i was like not in town so i haven't seen it in person obviously they sent me videos when they went to go see it and from the videos it looked really nice i honestly didn't have anything to say about it and my parents really liked it and i trust their opinion and they know me best so i really hope that i like it when i go to see it today because i mean we literally move in tomorrow like i have no choice and since we're getting the keys today we can technically start moving in like whenever we want obviously like i said tomorrow is like our official day to like get everything in there but since i'm getting the keys today i feel like once i get them i'm gonna load up whatever i can in my car just like whatever fits in there and just start moving some smaller things into my room just to get like a head start because i honestly have a lot of like smaller boxes like obviously the bigger boxes are probably gonna have to go in like the u-haul tomorrow but a lot of my boxes definitely fit in my car so i'm probably gonna like move those over today so yeah just starting off my day with my little bowl of oatmeal but i'm just gonna eat and then get ready i just have to get changed while i eat this i'm gonna be an ipad kid and start bridgerton season three part two guys i can't believe the day's here don't get it twisted though i'm still mad at them for making it into two parts because literally who does that and i know it's literally only gonna be like four episodes i'm gonna finish it today and then we're gonna have to wait like a whole year for the next season so don't get me wrong i know a lot probably goes into making a show like this but i'm like can they just like be filming the next season like at the same time as this so we don't have to wait as long whatever i gotta do what you gotta do i'm going to enjoy my breakfast with bridgerton most remarkable shade of blue i, I might say something like that if you were okay guys i just got dressed to go and pick up the keys even at very athleisure wear comfy vibes today because i just want to be comfy and be able to really move around easily because once i get the keys i kind of want to start moving some things into the room so i just wanted to wear something that allows me to move easily in and this is probably going to be the vibe for like the whole weekend just like workout clothes rompers all that good stuff i'm wearing this super cute black active jacket from marshall's like literally lulu who this is like the best dupe i've ever seen and it was only like $20. I'm just wearing like a sports bra underneath it and then these pink shorts I got from Walmart. I think I literally got them from like the kids section but I just think they're so cute. They're like a light pink color and then I just paired my outfit with these Nike sneakers. Go to bag from Target so we're all ready. Also I'm like halfway to the first episode of Bridgerton season 3 part 2 and I I can't like I literally can't like I'm literally screaming the entire time like I can't even watch it anyways can't wait to finish that but let's go get these keys and see this house okay I just filled up the car with all of my smaller boxes this is what the car looks like in here and then there's more boxes in the back Morning 
it's move-in day. Today's Friday, June 14th. It's just past 8.30. I woke up a few minutes ago, and so I'm literally just gonna get up and start getting ready, like, right away. I went back to the house again last night after my parents got out of work to help them bring more, like, their boxes and stuff, so... We got more of the boxes out of the way. I think my dad's loading up the car with even more boxes. I think we're trying to get all the boxes out with the cars so that there's plenty of room for all the furniture in the truck that's coming. So yeah, I still have like a couple of big boxes, but maybe my dad will be bringing those over later. Today's mostly gonna be about moving all the furniture, like my bed, my nightstand, dresser, all that stuff. It has to be dissembled. So that's why I have to get up right away before they probably have to kick me out of my bed because they have to take it apart. So, so I'm gonna strip my bed of all of its sheets and then get dressed. This is everything I have left. This is my dirty clothes hamper. It's literally just filled with like random stuff that's like probably gonna go into storage like in the basement. And then we have like all my hangers in this bag. Like I said, more boxes. These are mostly filled with all of my clothes in my closet. This is the big box and like the first over box that I packed in my last vlog. This is like a poster from high school that I'm keeping from memory. So that's probably gonna go into storage. And then these like bags are just filled with like my last minute stuff. Any clothes that I still had out because I was wearing them the past couple of days and like my skincare, makeup, I was finally able to pack that all. This is the remains of my desk slash vanity. We threw out the tabletop because it was disgusting. It was all peeled. My aunt took one of the Alex drawers, my little Ikea drawers. She took one of those for herself and then my mom wanted to keep this one for her closet. So this is coming along with this as well. But I'm getting a whole new vanity slash desk for the new room. So that's kind of what's left. And then of course we just have my main furniture like my dresser bed my little nightstand my nightstand and my dresser won't really be that hard to bring over because they don't really have to be dissembled the drawers just have to be taken out of them and then they can just be moved like that my bed is pretty much the only thing that has to be all separated and then moved over but so saying bye to this mirror i'm getting a new like full length mirror so i'm not sure if we're just getting rid of this one or if we're like selling it i think we're just gonna sell it because it's still a pretty good mirror i don't know i'm just not a fan of the style anymore or at least for the vibe that i want my new room to have so we're getting rid of her but yeah it's been real I'm gonna go ahead and take my sheets off and then get ready I just got dressed. I'm obviously keeping it very comfy for today since we're gonna be moving around a lot, but I'm in love with this romper. It's so cute. It's from VS Pink and it's from their Valentine's Day collection from this year and I am just obsessed with it. Like the little lace and everything, it just makes it so comfy but so cute. Just paired it with my Nike sneakers that I've been wearing and now I'm basically just gonna start putting some more things in my car. I have like my base bag, this tote bag, and just a bunch of these like little bags that definitely will fit in my car. I I already went ahead and put like my sheets and my pillows in there. These bigger boxes are probably gonna have to go in the truck. What, are you recording us? <laughs> Literally sweating. So bad, we got most of the stuff in. My parents are making one more trip to the house to bring everything here, like everything else that's left. I'm sure it's not really much, but this is currently the situation. All my small boxes, my bed frame, Princess's bed. Princess is here. Princess! Hi! She's like, what's going on right now? Closet, kind of like a little empty room tour for you guys. Look how big it is. I didn't even know there was a light in here either. This is like such a huge upgrade from my last closet. So much bigger and it actually has a light so I can see in here. Keep you guys updated. We're just gonna get kind of started on unpacking some stuff. I'm honestly just taking like a little break right now. I look like a hot mess. Like it's actually so hot outside. It doesn't help that this weekend is literally gonna be so far like the hottest weekend yet, so. Hey guys, it has been a day. Currently, 
5.36. Literally look like a hot mess. Like literally a hot mess. I'm sweating right now. Like you see my face. This isn't just my skin or like my skincare. I've literally been sweating balls all day. Every time we move, you know, we just think we have the superpower to handle everything on our own. So here we are. Yeah, my hair is just like not doing it for me right now. So please ignore that. I finished unpacking mostly everything. I still have a couple of boxes like out in some corners because I still don't have enough storage for them. I don't know if I mentioned earlier, but I'm getting a new vanity. So as of right now, I have no vanity, no desk, anything like that. So all the boxes that are like out like over here and here, those are things that I would normally store in like my vanity slash desk area. So until I get that, those are just going to stay in boxes. So I'm going to show you guys what the room looks like right now. There's actually a lot that I'm going to be changing. So it's not going to look exactly like this, but I just want to show you guys what it looks like for now. So little overview of kind of how it looks like day one. First things first, I do plan on changing the wall color. I do not like this like gray color. I find it very depressing. So I'm gonna be painting my walls white. That'll probably be going on sometime next weekend. So that's when that will happen. Like I said, I still have a couple of boxes packed because these are usually things that I like to store in my vanity. So when I get that, I was thinking of putting it like in this area, literally where my hamper is right now. There's like an outlet right there. So it'll just be the perfect place to put it in case I need to plug anything in. Like I said earlier, in my old room i got rid of the old full-length mirror that i used to have i'm gonna get a new one and it's gonna go here which i think is perfect because it's just like the perfect amount of space and it's right next to the window so it'll have like good lighting in front of the mirror speaking of the window i obviously don't have any curtains right now i will be getting those soon i was thinking of getting like light pink sheer curtains i feel like that would be really pretty i also really want to get like a new bedding set but not just like any bedding set like i want to get a good one something that's been on my wish list for like a long time now is some sort of bedding from durf avenue i think they have just the cutest like bed sets so i might get one of those for my bed and then i put my projector literally on top of my headboard because when it projects it projects perfectly onto this wall right here so i just have it here it's plugged in behind my bed but yeah it looks a little funny but it works so don't judge of course put my nightstand here it fit perfectly in this little area next to the bed it obviously Basically just has like random stuff on top of it now it's gonna be a little bit more decorated as I sell in more but put my dresser over here kind of like next to my closet door again I feel like everything that's like on top of the furniture is just very random and it's gonna change and look a lot more put together as the days go on I just have like my Mac and my iPad on top of here right now this is a hair clip and my camera cover this mirror is from Marshall's but I think I'm gonna get rid of it after I get my vanity because the vanity mirror that I want is literally exactly like this but obviously like way bigger so I feel like I don't want to have too many of like the same exact decorations in my room so I might like sell this or something I just have it in my room right now because I don't have any other mirror in my room so I obviously want to be able to see myself somehow when I wake up in the morning so I just have that here for now but I don't think I'm going to be keeping this I also have these fake flowers that I had on my vanity in my old room and I still think they're really nice I really love the vase I think I'm going to change up the flowers though like just for decoration I just want something different and I'm still going to keep my perfume tray here I'm not sure if I still want to keep this tray specifically I think I want to get some Something that's like gold to match like the other decorations in my room so I might change this up as well but we'll see then are you guys ready for the closet this is what I'm most excited about because it was quite the upgrade for me first of all it's huge I'll give you guys like a little overview right now hopefully my camera focuses but look at all this room and it has a light like I can actually see tell me this is not like such a huge upgrade I love it I brought these little like metal hooks that you just like hook onto your door from my old room so I'm able to like hang a bunch of stuff up on the inside of the door I have so many empty hangers it feels like I have no clothes even though in my other closet this literally filled up the whole closet but I have to remember that this closet is obviously just a lot bigger so it makes it look like I barely have like a stack of clothes but yeah I'm gonna have to like get rid of all these hangers probably and store them away because there's just way too many but my mom gave me this like bigger plastic dresser again I had another one in my old closet but it was a lot smaller but since this one is a lot bigger we kind of swapped because this one was hers and so I just have some random stuff on top of it again overall like as the weeks go on and I get like more decorations and stuff like a lot more like surfaces will become more like decorated and aesthetic just like I like them but for now I just need places to put stuff until I get more storage so I literally just have like my skincare and my makeup bag here another random bag my Marc Jacobs this is my nail box and then I just have a bunch more like random stuff here another bag this is like a little ottoman but I use it as a storage box for my bikinis I have my shark there my base bag and then all of my shoes literally the perfect storage and then this shelf for all of my pants it's literally the perfect storage space so that is the first and like current room tour like I said a lot of things are going to be changing in here as the weeks go on I'm really excited and I will obviously be sure to keep you guys updated throughout the vlog yeah just that I 
show you guys what it looks like now obviously just so you can see and you can like see all the changes i'm gonna make but honestly i'm really happy with this room i honestly didn't think i was gonna like it at first because i did find it kind of small but i feel like my bed actually fit perfectly in here it doesn't take up too much room if anything i feel like it's almost the same size as my old room except the closet is way bigger so i'm really happy about that but anyways guys i am literally exhausted not wait to shower so i'm gonna jump in now and just get ready for bed even though it's pretty early but i'm literally so tired i honestly might knock out like so early but i'll keep you guys updated and i'll see you tomorrow good morning i woke up a little while ago and i already had breakfast and coffee and completely forgot to vlog but that's okay because that's the only thing i did currently just laying down chilling with princess my parents are currently trying to set up the dining table we pretty much got all of the boxes cleared out of the living room and like i showed you guys last night my room is pretty much all fully set up we're just going to be making obviously a lot of changes within the next couple of weeks but i'm excited we have a couple of errands to run today so that's kind of what today is going to be all about we have to go to the store get a couple of things we literally have to buy a mailbox i don't know why we don't have one but we need to buy one but I'm gonna get ready for the day soon. Right now I'm just chilling and then we will go about our day. It's currently 10 o'clock, so let's go. more but i'm basically just wearing a dress that i was sent from quince so cute it's just like this gorgeous like dusty pink color this is what it looks like i'm just wearing some like white slides right now but i'm probably gonna change my shoes before we actually go out and then i just pinned my hair back did some light no makeup makeup so yeah we're ready for the day we're still not going out just yet but i believe my mom wants to go make a couple of store runs andre's also coming over in like a couple of hours so he can come and see the house because he hasn't seen it yet so he'll be coming over and we're probably just gonna chill for a little bit but yeah <laughs> it's got mommy that's the one you like cute <laughs> 